right, let's get into it. 1972 Oldsmobile Cutlass Convertible. This car was painted this year. Top is this year as well. Floors, frame, all of that was done this year. It's not a whole lot to point out on this car, but the things I do know, I'm gonna show you guys. Everything has been touched. Like I said, floors, frame, trunk pan, it's all been done. Gorgeous top. Gotta love the cloth tops and the color just absolutely sets it off. This one's got all new interior. All right, you guys know how we do it. So that's the quick overview. Now let's get into it. This car is super solid in between the doors. Let's go check out the door bottoms. Same on the passenger side. The paint is super deep. Very, very nice. The owner did drive the car, so it's not absolutely perfect, but very, very close to it. Nothing to see on the interior. Did put that set of gauges in there, which is, uh, I think tastefully done. Same thing, let's check out those door bottoms. There was a little bit of chip in there on the bottom of the door, but as you see, no rust. So that just lets you know what's up under there. Body work on this car is pretty amazing. There's one spot here in the paint, or I guess they were adjusting the uh, door alignment. You can't see it from five feet away. And it's really hard to see even once you're up on it. It's just something I know is there. The chrome on this car, is all in great shape super nice driver quality chrome mirrors and all that stuff are brand new let's pop the hood hear this thing run pop the trunk and then we'll get it up on the lift so you can know exactly what we're looking at all right so this is an absolute cold start the car has been sitting in my shop all weekend two pumps on the gas get into the function of the top i never like to let these down without having the car running it's a strain on the battery in my opinion
I would address on this car. She's got a solid header panel. So nothing really to touch there. You could change the fabric if you chose to. Um, they did not paint this top frame while they had the top off. That's easily done. See if I can hit the trunk key right on the first try. Deck lid is in really, really nice shape. They did a great job on the paint, like I said. For, trunk pan is all brand new. Nothing to hide, no surprises. The quarters were changed out. They're brand new as well. We'll get it up on the lift. There's a chip right there at the bottom of that door. They close up absolutely straight and perfect. As you can see the gaps there. It's got a nice set of Cutlass rallies on it. They did the custom red stripe in the style of the hearse. This door doesn't have any chipping on it whatsoever. And again, closes up absolutely perfect. We'll get this one up on the lift and let you see what we got. Catch this in somewhere, but one other thing that I want to make sure to mention on this car is when the owner went through the motor, they resealed everything, um, tuned it all up, it runs great but they did not put heat back in the car. My assumption there is that if you want heat, you're gonna need a heater core. Then she's got a nice amount of firewall back there. Perfect to set up if you wanna put vintage air in this car. Running video, driving video of this Cutlass. I haven't been able to get it done because my phone won't stop ringing. But. up under this 1972 Cutlass. Fuel tank is either new or has been replaced recently. Frame is pretty solid. Floor pans have been replaced. Saw solid metal, new exhaust. Couple of things of note um, for me. It is not the best floor pan job I've ever seen but definitely not the worst. It definitely gets the job done. Uh, and the same with the trunk pan. They did not cut out the old pan before dropping in the new one. You can see where the old one was rotted. 
the new one's welded in on top and it's actually welded in there's a couple little spots um, that for me i would address in the future on the frame extension common stuff i would plate that and there's one right here on the part that holds the bumper um, typical stuff just things that again if i was in here doing all this work i would have done but everybody's not me of note the chrome on the rocker i couldn't see this on the ground but she's got a couple of dents in her and there is just a little crease here at the side of the uh passenger door but that's the car in a nutshell nice car body lines are extremely straight Orders are on there extremely straight. 72 Oldsmobile Cubs.